Alright guys, so a beta came out for this game called Rainbow Six Siege. Now I've always been a fan of Rainbow, game, Rainbow Six games as they had this mode called Terrorist Hunt. I think it was called something else before, to be honest. Is it, was it? I can't remember. I haven't played Rainbow Six game in a long, long time. And I was very excited for this game and now the open beta came out Oh my god, this is like uh, amazing. It's not like uh, it's like uh, uh, it's amazing. I don't know how to describe it. So instead of trying to describe it to you, I shall show you. Uh, uh, I shall. I can speak today. Today is Black Friday. Okay, look, I did some shopping and didn't do any. Today, I mean, Rainbow Six Terrorist Hunt. Instead of trying to describe it, I shall show you what it looks like. Alright, so let's get into Terrorist Hunt. What you see at the top is there are two currencies. One's Rainbow Six Coins and the other one is something else. And I'm not sure how it works. I think you can buy one using real life money. Yes, I think there are microtransactions because if you go to the shop, there is... There isn't. I don't know. This is still like a uh, not not really an early version, but it's. I, I'm not. I don't think it's a finished version. It's a beta to show us and test what the game is like. All right. So let's go into Terrorist Hunt, and we are going to do Lone Wolf. I don't want to play with people. I want to try my best at doing it on my own, and we're gonna play normal. As I've played normal before, and it's pretty difficult. I don't know if it's me being bad at the game, or if it's actually very good AI. And the AI is amazing, even on the easiest, which is normal. The AI is very good. Alright, so we're gonna use the recruit, as I haven't unlocked anyone yet. But after this one, I think I should be able to afford a better character. So I'm an SAS with an L85A2. SMG at my secondary, breach charge, and a frag grenade. Alright, and uh, spawn point, I have not played on this map yet. At least I don't think so. I think I did two maps, two different maps, and I don't think I did this one. Alright, let's see. No, I have not done this map. Okay, that is... Well, that's gonna be a new experience for all of us. Uh, for you guys who haven't played the game, and for me, as I have not done this map yet. Alright, looks like a quite big building, indoor shooting, that's not good. Because that means there is a lot of, there is a lot of corridors and a lot of places they can, um, they can shoot me. Which is not good, as we do not want to get shot. Uh, let's see. Can I open this? No, I can't. Alright, let's see what ways we can go in. Well, there is a couple ways. Is this, um... No, I'm just completely locked in. Yeah. I'm trying to find a spot where I could uh, throw my drone in and check out what's inside. So that way I would have some idea at least how many of them there are inside. And I could mark some of them as well. I can't really find a good way to enter this place. Let's see. Is this a, is this part of the building as well? That that door is very small. Um so I don't think it is. No, because I think this is where the map finishes, is it? Yeah. Alright, so this place is not part of the actual main map. So the main part we're focusing is this big building, which is still quite large. Alright, let's try to find a way to get in. Is this? Yes, I think we should be able to get in through here. Alright, let's hide behind some cover, so that way we don't get shot while we're... Um, trying to figure out the way in and let's throw a drone 
All right, wonderful. It landed on the roof, but we don't need it on the roof. We need it on the ground. All right, so as you can see, there are these gaps under these barricades, which can go through with your drone. And that allows you to get into the base and mark enemies. For some reason, they mark the enemy clearly. I can see it. Come on. What do you mean, no enemies detected? Do I have to be in a room with it? There we go. All right. Now, for some reason, he didn't see the drone. That's, well, that's good, I guess. But they can actually see the drones, and they will start shooting the drones when they realize something is not right. What the hell? As you can see, this guy started shooting at us. So let's get out of here <laughs> so they don't destroy it. And what I'm trying to find is the bomb. Uh, because... In this mode, what we want to do is find a bomb that we need to defuse. Which is pretty damn difficult. Because the second you place a defuser, everyone on the map runs at you and tries to kill you. It's just wonderful. Oh god, there was a guy next to me. Ah, uh, mark him. Uh, run. Let's see what else we have. A bomb has been located. Oh, I just jumped into his face. <laughs> Alright, we found one of the bombs, that's good. Hey. Oh, wrong way, wrong way. Uh, Alright. I wish you could actually use the um, the drone that we're using now as a some sort of explosive that just allows you to explode the enemies. Um, that allows you to, well, not explode the enemies, but you know, just the drone explodes, some, has some sort of explosive set to it, to, so that you can detonate it and. We've located a bomb. And this is location bomb. and plant the diffuser. Hmm, not very ideal places for the bombs, as. Um, not really many places to hide. Hi. Bye. Alright, I'll leave the drone here. Wait, does that mean it's gonna get out here? I think it was here on the side that we destroyed it. Oh, maybe behind. Wait, is this... Oh, the drone was dead. I destroyed it. Alright, I didn't mean to do that. Let's place the drone here and pick it up. Alright, so one of the bombs is above and one of the bombs is below. Now, <coughs> I think the bomb at the top floor had a better spot to defuse it. So what I think we're gonna do is we're gonna go upstairs and maybe try clearing the place from top to bottom. Now this will allow us to make sure that we don't get hit from above. Let's see. I'm just checking if there's any any enemies here that could um, it could become a danger to us when we get in. Apart from him, I don't see anyone. Uh, let's see. No, I think it should actually be good. Now the bomb is one floor below us, so we can make our way one floor down. Then, yeah, he destroyed it. And then we can do some shooting as well. Alright, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back again, so that we can pick up the drone. And... And then, 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 then... We're going to go in. Now I'm not sure if we're going to breach to be honest, because uh, I feel like that's a waste of breeze. So what I'm gonna do is just shoot the cover. Oh god, he was here. 
I did not see him. Crap. Well, I just let it have one again. And he destroyed the barrier for me. Thanks for that. <laughs> uh, now let's see. Let's just proceed slowly. The thing is, when you get caught in the barbed wire, they notice you straight away. So you need to be very careful. And the sounds in this game are amazing. And I can hear a guy on the staircase, so I'll just throw that for him. And that did not kill him. Wonderful. Let's see. Oh, the barbed wire is just killing me. Alright. I think they're gonna be coming up the stairs. Let's just camp. Now these guys are just killed with the, with the ones with the red and blue light. They will come up to you and they will blow up like this. And they will mess you up if you're not careful. Oh, I'm flushed. Rip. Yeah, so alive. This guy behind us. He's trying to flank us. Okay, they're gonna get us from behind. It's not good. Okay, yeah, they know I'm in the barbed wire. <coughs> One's right here. It's only one way into this room, that's good. Let's see. They don't seem to want to come up. It's not good. Let's try pushing forward a little bit. Oh, there's a guy in here. Nice, we're getting for the wall. Headshot? Oh, nice. Screw out this room before. See, I checked this room, but there was no one here before. And now there is a guy. I either missed him or he moved here. Whew. That was nice. Alright, let's slowly make our way down. Oh, the sea is right here. Oh, that's bad. Because I cannot see a single thing because of that light. Let's move out. Alright, we're outside. I don't think there's anyone outside, that's good. But this light is in a very bad spot. I don't think that's an enemy. Although there is one there. You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna throw our friendly. Um, why is he not throwing it? Um, hello? Hello? Drop the drone, maybe? Yeah. Okay then, here's a glitch. Early version for you, right there. But there he is behind the wall. I think I got him. Alright, you probably can hear a peep, beeping noise. That noise means there is a C4 nearby. And that C4 is gonna mess up, mess us up badly. If we don't destroy it, let's see. Let's 
reason there is. Boom, the fuse. Whew. There's quite a lot of them here. Alright, the bomb is here. We need to find the... What was that? Whew. We need to find a good place where we can camp. Oh my god, so many bombs. Here. Um, any more? These are many bombs at the place. Alright, that's all. Alright, let's refill and let's. If I can. Ah, there we go. Alright, we're gonna refill. And let's. Yeah, I think I'm gonna hide here so we can have a shot at people coming from here. And then, if we need to, we can just. Yeah, I think this is gonna be a good place. Alright. Get ready to get wrecked. <laughs> Diffuser planted. Defended from enemy action. Alright. And now. They're gonna come from literally everywhere. Oh no, that's bad. That is very bad. Uh, operators. New operator, and I think it was DHG IQ 500. We got 524. That is not enough. Not good. Not good. Alright, you know what, guys? I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye bye.